Well, Coach, to be here, Class C state title. We've spoken all the way on the road here to this game, and just what you could say about the moment. It's just, I can't even describe it. It's just so, it's just so, I, I don't even have words for it. It's just so great, you know, just seeing how happy the kids are and stuff. You work so hard for all this stuff, and you finally, you just, it's their last seniors last game and stuff and ending like that you couldn't ask for anything more and so many seniors we got to see all of their <laughs> pictures up here all the the jersey posters and everything just what it means to you to to have this class do what it did this year ah uh, just it's the ultimate goal i mean we just uh, you can't ask for anything more we had a lot of fun doing it hard very hard working uh we, uh, we we learned a lot from each other and uh, just just couldn't ask for more you when you sat down with sunny spear and i you brought xander arnold Dubs Hawk and Tyler Hayes, and they all did a tremendous job tonight in the state final and all throughout the season. Uh, sure did, sure did. They're uh, they're three of our leaders. We got some more leaders that are on our team too. And uh, yeah, again, uh, lifetime of memories too. I mean, just great memories, and uh, just could not be happier. Low scoring game, but you're able to gut it out and do it on the <clears throat> ground where you've been very successful. Just what you can say about kind of finding your spots in, in a game that was really close, especially in the first half. Yeah, and, uh, you know, we said, you know, we felt like uh, we, we knew it was going to be hard to come by getting yards and stuff, but uh, we felt that we we eventually could wear them down because we just thought that the kids that we have and we, you know, rotating them in and stuff like that, and I think I think that's what we did. The balance between Xander and Dub is just what you could say about the give and take. I know they razz each other a little bit. Yeah, they're, uh, they're, it's amazing. You, their stats, you should see their stats. They have almost the same number of carries, same number of yards, same number of touch. It's just, it's uh, it's great. You talk about a one-two punch. It's uh, mixed play calling a whole lot you know, a whole lot easier, so let me tell you. To be in front of your fan base, they have a cheer for you. So do you hear that when you're out there? Do you hear that the Hogan cheer? Uh, once in a while. Yeah, <laughs> once in a while, yeah. I, I love it. I, I, I heard him at the end there, so that's good. And of course, my son's playing too. They probably cheer for him too. So, yeah, it's uh, it's nice. They're, we, we have the best fans around, I think. I've always said that, especially our student section. They're good. They're great. Of course, we have a we, we have a great following anyway. We're very proud of that. So to do this with your son and not just with your son but your son on the field i know you embraced him after the game just bring me into that moment and what goes through the head of a father when you're a coach and a dad just uh you know he's he's been a water boy you know so long like well, since he was six or seven years old and you know finally he said he goes wow he goes this is a lot i'm a whole lot more nervous now and you know of course he would be but you know just to see just how happy he was and you know having having you know now he is a, a state champion he now has a medal that he says is going to mean a whole lot more to him <laughs> and uh, just couldn't be prouder. You know, him and my daughter, of course. You know, being a, you know being on the sideline with us, just it's just that's that's awesome too. And Dave, final note, just what you want to say to that community that you feel so highly for, it, and to this team for everything they fought through, not just this season to get to where they are, but last season and everything we've all had to fight through the last couple of years. Just what you want to say to the players and to the community to not only win the state title, but to do it after so much adversity with the pandemic. I mean, I just, I just could not be as grateful as I am right now. I mean, these these people will never know how truly. I, I mean, these kids will never know what they what they've done for us as coaches. I mean, they're just, it just carries on forever. I mean, we've we've, I mean, people that we coached 15 years ago are, are reaching out to us, you know, today, wishing us luck and stuff, and, and it's just, uh, it just goes on forever. I mean, I, I you know, I, I, we we love these kids and we'll always love these kids and sharing these memories and. Uh, it's just going to be so great. I thank them so much from the bottom of my heart for what they've done for us.